Hey guys, welcome back to the sixth board of Classic Mario Party. Today we are doing DK's Jungle Adventure. I know that DK didn't win the last board, but this is actually one of the last main character boards for this game. We have a few more boards to do, but they're more story oriented. Here in the jungle stand the mysterious ruins. Rumor has it that a great treasure is hidden here. If you look for this treasure, surely one of you will find it. But beware! There are many traps in this jungle. Whatever you do, don't step on the question mark spaces, as your safety cannot be guaranteed. Gee, thanks, Koopa. I totally feel safe with that. And hey, I'm actually not going last. Yeah, the host of this board DK is going first. And we got Mario going last. Alright, where's this first star going? Well, nobody's gonna be getting that for a while. Will they? We'll see, though. You know, if we can get high enough rolls, we'll be able to get over there pretty quick. Alright, to show off this board. So, there are a couple of gimmicks to this particular board. Uh, we'll get into at least the main one, which is that you have these WAPs here that you have to pay 10 coins to pass if the star happens to be in this direction. So, if I roll higher than a 4, then I have to pay 10 coins to pass. And if I can't pass, then I can't go that way. Uh, you have these little coin stones here. Which I believe you have to have 20 coins in order to pass through, so, you know, if the star happens to be, like, in this little area, you're kind of screwed from getting it if you don't have 20 coins. Go up here, and we got Boo! We know what he does by now. Uh, we have another little coin stone here, and Bowser! With this big bad Bowser event. Maybe we'll actually see that this time, because I know we didn't see it in the last board. The star is currently over here. Got another wall. And behind him, we've got another boo? What is this? This is the only board in the entire game with two boos. I don't know why this is, but... Kinda cool, I guess. You have a few opportunities to steal from the other players. Yeah, that's not good that I got such a high roll. Actually, if I go that way, I can get a one-player minigame. Sure, I might be able to make those coins up that I'm about to lose. Oh yeah, the second gimmick of this board we will get into when somebody lands on the happening space. But what I will say is that it will hinder your progress towards getting any stars that are a further away distance. Oh hey, it's Ground Pound. I am not gonna screw up like the computer players do. Star. As I say that, I screw up anyway. Yeah, so as you saw there, Peach couldn't pass there because she couldn't have 10 coins. Mario can because he changes positions. Oh hey, we haven't seen this minigame in a while. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Yeah, I'm trying to fake out the other players. You know, by going to the other colors. <laughs> Not working, though. Uh. <laughs> okay. I'm the first one out. <laughs> Bye, Mario. Uh, you just saw it here. Everybody failed, so the minigame ended in a draw. <laughs> okay, this is a great start already. Because I remember the last board and how that minigame also ended in a draw. <laughs> okay, let's move along with this. I don't have enough coins. Maybe with Boo, though. Uh, I was kind of hoping for a poison mushroom, actually. Um... Alright, maybe I get a wand? No! Oh well. I mean, the best I could hope for right now is possibly a warp block switch. This mini game too. Yeah! All right. Well, I can finally talk about this as well since we just had that happen in uh, that mini game. So yeah, I was playing with three other computer players, and this ended in a draw. I'm still not sure what happened that day, but I just remember. We all pressed the right button, and somehow we all failed the minigame. Pretty good in the mini game so far. Oh, this is safe. But there's definitely time for me to screw up. You know. All right, I have options here. Uh, if I go down, I'm missing out on boo. Then I also gotta pay ten coins anyway. I'm just gonna go down. I kind of defend my current point game.
And Mario gets the first star. Where is this one going? Ah! <laughs> oh, that stinks for me. I think I'm right on top of it. Well, that's unfortunate. Very unfortunate. Also, we got Coin Block Bash with Peach holding the hammer. I am gonna get that hammer as far away from Peach as possible. Cause she's probably gonna be going after me, being at first and all. Ugh. Alright, well, I'll just focus on getting the coins then. I mean, not that that mattered with DK getting the hammer. Since there was only one coin left. Twelve coins, though. I'm not doing too bad. Okay, you could have stole from me and got more coins, but I guess since you're programmed to always go for first place players. And he's also rolling again! Well, he can potentially get the star next turn. Well, if he gets, gets it high enough. What am I doing? There we go. Ten! Against Peach and all over. It's like Peach's birthday cake all over. No. But we did get a lot of bowl over in that board though. I was no threat to Peach, was I? <laughs> yeah, I have mentioned before that my strategy is generally to just separate myself from the other players. Seems to work out so far. Okay, gets a star too! Yeah. Hey, I could have actually got that. Well, actually, no, because I got a high roll last turn. Still. It'll be a while before anybody gets that.
Hey, maybe I can get some more coins. I'm on the far right, too. This could benefit me a little bit. No. 